Yo, what's going on guys? Gonna be showing you the power of Blitzcrank jungle. You may not believe it and neither do my teammates, but Blitzcrank is a legit jungler. I've tested it out and you can do a leash list solo for camp clear, full HP, finish 250. Pretty nuts. For those of you who don't know why, Blitzcrank got a big overwork this patch, which is live and in ranked. And basically what it did was it gave him a lot more damage, a lot more attack speed, and some bonus damage against monsters as well, particularly on his E. His W on every single auto attack also does bonus damage now to basically, he's a good jungler and an insane ganker and decent scaling. For your keystones, you have a lot of options. Predator is good, but it's going to set you up to lose all your one verse ones. So I wouldn't really recommend Predator. So instead, you generally want to go for Conquer or Hell of Blades. We have the Conquer, Triumph, Alacrity, Coup de Grasse setup. You can go for Tenacity, but attack speed works really well in Blitzcrank now, since when you're on your W, all your auto attacks do max health damage. Then we have Hex Flash, because you wear Blitzcrank, plus Cosmic Insight. I told my teammates not to leash, because I don't need it. Like, they, your teammates can leash you, there's nothing wrong with that. I don't want the enemies to know where I start, though. You kind of want to start on blue side. Because you want to have red buff for as long as possible. It's more valuable, more damage, more slows. So that's the thought process. You want to max your E first, Q second, and W last. W per level doesn't get enough stats. But level 1 is by far your best ability. Auto attack E reset. Since we are Blitzcrank, our ganks are kind of nuts. I'm going to smite. I don't want to waste my mana shield right now. Back to full HP. Just be aware, a lot of people are going to think you're trolling until they know this is meta. Not many people have caught on to the recent changes that are live, so... Try to assure your teammates that you're not trolling. The easiest way is to tell them in champ select, like leash list, 250, full HP type of thing. That seems to soothe their nerves. At this point, we can gank. We'll go for the Scion. We hit a Leashless crossing through middle around 230. That's really, really good. This middle part. Three camp. That is something that a meta jungler could do with a leash. This is a fat wave. I'm disappointed in York. I'm going to W into him. Auto attack. E reset into Q. And we just need one more auto on him. I'm going to try to block him off, get him with the knockup. And we're chilling, dude. You generally don't want to gank when there's this many minions. The only reason I did, because it was absolutely free. But usually if they have more than two minion waves, it's bad. Because your teammate's going to miss a lot of CS. So, oh, she's dead. Auto attack, E reset. Look at these autos. We're going to hold on to Q for as long as possible. We still have mana shield. We have Conqueror built up as well. Ooh, got her with that E knockup. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> woo, woo. <laughs> I'm telling him, man. They didn't believe me. They didn't want to believe that Blitz jungle is the sauce. So with your E on Blitzcrank, once the animation starts, it cannot be stopped. Even if the enemy's hourglass, even if they bartle you, your E will go through. It's just a special interaction. Auto attack E reset. So only a fraction of our E animation had started there on the Evelyn. Maybe like a tenth. And then we got Charm. But our E follows through. She dies. We fought Evelyn when we had less HP than her. She couldn't fight us. We're Conqueror Blitzcrank, baby. If we were Predator, we probably couldn't have soloed her there. It's just something to keep in mind. Draven's losing lane. That's not pretty. They have Malphite support too. Malphite's been buffed recently. I want to do a video on him. They gave him better AP scaling. Yeah, but Conk, Conk's better, I think. You can go lethal tempo, but you it's not as smooth as you think it would be. All right, we're going to run him down. Auto attack, E reset. Pull him into my teammate here. Got his flash. He's really low too, so he's going to have to base. We should go ahead and base at this point. Unless Syndra's here. I used my oracles a little too soon. I don't know if this brush is warded. We could hex flash out of brush. We have our speed up to close distance. We have E to knock up, then Q. You pretty much always want to knock them up before you Q. Because... 
you don't want to miss your cute. I went for the knockup kind of early there. Get her with the hook. Her minions actually got in the way. <laughs> like, big time. We would have had more space to auto attack, E reset, and take our time, slow her down with our red buff autos, and use our movement speed advantage. Since the minions were there and she was getting so close to the turret, it forced us to speed things up a lot. Auto attack, E reset, we'll smite it down. You can take Raptors and Krugs in your first clear. You generally don't want to until you have red buff, though. Red buff helps you a lot with the speed, but you can take them. Your best clear on Blitzcrank is what I showed you guys, which is basically do your full blue side into red buff and gank. Because once you're level 3, you want to be ganking. Let's go ahead and... Let's go ahead and go for... Man, we could honestly go Titanic Rush. We could go tier two boots though. Tier two boots wouldn't be bad. I'm down for Titanic. You have a lot of options on Blitzcrank. Don't be mad at me because you see someone else running something else. Or if it turns out a different item technically has a better overall win rate. Generally, Turbo is going to be one of your safest options, especially if you're the main engage for your team. Sunfire is going to be amazing for long prolonged fights and shredding. Titanic Rush, dude. I like it. I don't like the idea of building Blitzcrank AP. It makes you more Hulk reliant than I would like. And your W gives you so much base attack speed that I'd rather have Titanic for the shred. You end up with more damage this way than just rushing down Chem Tank. And we're already fast enough with tier 2 boots that we don't really need the Chem Tank. We're almost level 6. Scion can't fight York. York's a hard match if he puts him in the cage. Puts him in wage cage and Scion gets enslaved. Run him down. Oh, wow. He straddled that really well. Well played to him. We got our R. We'll head over mid. Well, we could just hex flash this wall, actually. I don't have my hook here. Going to put an auto on each one of these. Help him shove it. Yeah, this guy's a goner. Auto attack E reset. We'll get him with an R and run out. I don't know where Eve is, but we do have Flash and Blue Smite, so we should be fine. We're also on the other side of the map when her red buff's spawning in. York says, nice. Ooh, cool. I canceled my recall. Hot dang. That's unfortunate. I want to get team at for the AoE damage. Titanic's not a meme item. It's insanely good first item rush on someone like Warwick. It's not horrible on a Nocturne. I, I like it a lot. Any champion who has an attack speed steroid and something that speeds up your attack speed, Titanic is uh, inherently a decent first item rush. We'll still go for Chem Tank though or Sunfire. I'm thinking Sunfire, so we'll just do double on hit. You have a lot of options. You can build him AP. I don't want to, though. Oh, hey, friend. Auto attack E reset. No, you're not going anywhere, my dude. <laughs> oh, that sucked. Oh, I don't have my Q. Got her with the blue smite. She flashed. That sucks, man. We almost had Eve. I flashed hard, but she... R and countered my, out my R. Time to hex flash out a brush. Lock him down. Oh, the juke. That was filthy. Doesn't look like my teammates want a dragon. I would like a dragon. Auto attack E reset. They're probably just happy I'm not inting. They were thinking in jab select. They're like, are you trolling? I'm like, nah, I'm not. Taking dragon down real quick with our max health damage on W. Oh, this is bad. Oh. That's my bad. I didn't even have smite. I just baited my team there. I rally with the pop off though. She almost has it. She's on cooldowns. Ah, that's my fault. I feel bad now. I threw so hard. 
The nice thing about Swifties is it counteracts your own movement speed slow from your W. You can actually get around the map pretty fast with W if you go Swifties. And also just get around faster on the map in general. Blitzcrank has a very bad base movement speed of 325. It's one of his biggest weaknesses. Your clear is even faster with your R since you get the passive electricity. Auto attack, dub, auto attack E reset. Your W is not an auto attack resetter. Yeah, that was really troll on my part. Might as well play for double herald at this point in the game early, and then we'll do a part two. Playing for dragon soul since they're already upper dragon and we have none. It's going to take forever to end this game if we do that. Dude, this clear is ridiculous. Every time you auto attack, your R puts it out. That's what it seems like. Making those attack after one second, they're shocked. Yeah, every auto attack is basically shocking them. If you did want to build an AP, you could pick up Nasher like a Diana would do and get some huge damage. I'll try out a bunch of different Blitzcrank builds and make videos on them. Maybe I'd prefer the Nash. I don't know. Oh, this is awkward. I'm about to get rounded up. I'll attack E reset. I'll attack R. And down she goes. Red buff burn kills. I'm going to go ahead and unmute my team now. Oh, after I trolled him on Dragon. <laughs> York says there's no way. <laughs> and we're with Team Matt on Blitzcrank too. The base damage is too high, honestly. Getting a little extra 50 damage on every auto attack from your R is kind of nuts. That's why you don't want to R too early. Once you use your R, you no longer get that extra damage per auto attack. We'll hex flash over this wall like a Rek'Sai would do. And a blue smite him and a knock up. Get him with the hook. Yorks didn't follow that up at all. It's whatever though. He's got a lot of minions. Bot lane struggling. I need to get Harold. Evelyn's right here. She's not going to stop to break ward though. I could go ahead and take Harold really fast. The max health damage on W is just actually too good you saw how fast we were taking that dragon if only we had smite we would have had it you max e first because it gets so much extra bonus damage against monsters your e also does scale off of physical damage so it's not really troll to build a uh, ad blitzcrank his easy is only ability but we're maxing it first it's our main ability Got him with blue smite, knock him up, pop him with the QR, walk away. We have Swifty, so we can walk away. I'm going to let Yorick take it. That Herald's going to one-shot that turret. When Yorick's on a big enough lead, there's very few champions that can match it, because Maiden does as much as an AD carry if you're controlling it properly. Auto attack E reset. Leave our W on. I'm going to hold on to Q since I'm in dangerous territory. Could be nice to have. That juicy, juicy damage there. My flash is up. I have my mana shield as well. Got the hook and the knock up and I'm a flash. We were in really deep there. Almost died. Sheesh. They got our bot for that's not good. Caitlyn's full item, Draven's down. 800 goldish. Malphite support might actually be worth it after all those buffs he got. You never really wanna use your R on the monsters because you get way more damage from its on hit than you do from uh, the active over time. What did York say? Been a while since I had jungle who actually strong sided me. Yee, buddy. Oh, that's not good. They might have vision of me over here, too. I gotta leave. I don't feel like dying to Evelyn. York's taking two turrets. He's unstoppable. I'll play for next Herald. We'll literally end the game with second Herald. We'll wait till their team's out of position. 
I think we go for... I'm down for Sunfire, honestly. For them to... Yeah, it, it's easy. Like, the second Herald, they'll go for a Dragon or something. I mean, York will snap the base. It's going to be over. He has Trinity Force, too, which is a lot of pushing power. Look at that damage, boy. Your E scale is 150% extra bonus damage against monsters. And in general, it has 200% AD scaling against everything. So that, that's really, really high. There's very few abilities in the game that have that type of AD scaling. The only one that comes to mind is MFR. Misfortune R has ridiculous AD scaling. You justify it because it's not CC. And she has to stand still to cast it, but still. Eve can't even gank that. And Evelyn that's behind can't do anything to a Yorick who's ahead like that. Who's full HP. Eve full combo will do a fourth of his health. And York will kill her in two auto attacks. We're all kind of grouping up mid here. Can't decide between Chem Tank and Sunfire. They'd both be really good. Sunfire for the on hit and better stats. Chem Tank for the engage. They're thinking about whether or not they want to collapse on my York. They should. I can't full fight on this. Oh, we missed. I didn't want to overextend because it was Eve and Syndra. Maybe. Ooh. Yeah. I mean, I did ping it out to be fair. York didn't have to go all in like that. I'm a bit out of position. I got to pull this away. They might still come for me. Auto attack E reset. Don't mind if I do. I wonder if they're thinking about dragon right now. They should be thinking about dragon. Let's see if this is warded. Oh, it is. Dang. Auto attack E reset. He's on a very short cooldown at this point. Hey, Caitlyn. Auto attack E reset. Auto attack R. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> yeah. Draven's most likely getting frustrated. Look at that clear, dude. No way. Outrageous. What was Riot thinking? Blitzcrank's actually god tier. Just got to build Titanic, baby. We could take Dragon since Kate's dead. I messed it up. My biggest mistake of the game was forcing that Dragon when we didn't really have Pryo. And I didn't have Smite was so bad. This Dragon makes sense though because Caitlyn's in base. Don't know why I rally would leave early. That's kind of poop. Waiting for my smite. There we go. I can flash wall on her. Hey friend, get the knock up into silence. I have no clue how I rally a miss stun when I landed my hook into knock up. That is bizarre. <laughs> she threw her stun out so far. That was so strange. Oh man, York just died. That's unfortunate. Ooh. I assume E doesn't have R. Auto attack, E reset, get her with the hook. She's dead. My R is going to be up soon. It's going to be a lot of extra damage against the Scion. We can cancel his R. I mean, we can cancel his knockup, his charge hammer knockup with our E, our Q, or our R. There we go. Now we play. Oh, wait, we didn't get the second Herald. Dang. That sucks. I really wanted the second Herald and end. I completely just ignored it. That's unfortunate. Is what it is. <laughs> we have the most KP in the game. <laughs> I have to try an AP Blitzcrank jungle, man. Gotta see what that's all about. I've seen it. 
It, it didn't look as good as this, though. The AD scaling is four times higher than your AP scaling on your E. Your E basically doesn't even scale off of AP. I'm sitting on a lot of gold. Low-key, don't even want to get a tank item. I kind of just want to go full AD Blitzcrank. I don't think chem tank is 100% necessary. From here on out, I'm thinking we go for kind of mobility. The more HP we build, the more damage Titanic will give us. If we go full tank, Titan Titanic Hydra in total will give us somewhere around 80 or 90 AD, which is like two full 80 items on its own. So that should be the move. Red buff coming up in three. They're all swarming on... Uh, Yorick here. I don't think Scion can solo Yorick. Yorick has Hole Break. Hole Break's an insane item. Malphite's scary. I don't like him. He's gonna be really hard to deal with. I wonder if Eve's there. He caged super early. Lose some item, block it. Get the knock up. <laughs> Knocked him straight out of that. He's just trying to kill the minions now. I'm trying to stop him from uh, killing all the minions. Let's, let's keep going. I need to get back into the jungle for mana regeneration. We're only at 3.5 here. Yeah, push those minions, dude. <laughs> we take the wave instantly, bro. <laughs> so strong. Syndra's out of position. AKA, if I can see her, dude, she's out of position. Oh, I've seen that flashing for. I don't know if I have enough damage though. She's a little above half health. York gets a turret off of it. I get some more camps. I'll leave that control word there. Give some vision on Eve. York needs to leave though. He's gonna die. They're all swarming him. I gotta take up space on the map so he doesn't die for. Oh, sick! He got a double. He's still alive, too. He's wasting so much of their time. That's actually really good. That's really, really good. We're taking mid turret. We're taking bot turret. They lost out on several minion waves for that. Spent a lot of resources on him. Yep, that's huge. They lost two turrets. Just chasing him around. Perfect, and two of them died for it. I think Eve would walk through here. <laughs> Draven has a bounty, he's one in three. Draven's sicko mode over there. Oh, their whole team's kind of here. I didn't really want to fight though. Yeah, this is sketchy as heck. I didn't want to fight. Once I saw it was their whole team, I knew we shouldn't. I really ended up going in, either not seeing there all there, or she just straight up didn't care. I'm going to hex flash this wall, dude. Watch me. Hey, friend. Blue smite. Knock up. Block is R. No clue where Eve's at. My Q straight up missed. She doesn't have R, down she goes. I mean, he can go for inhib, it doesn't matter to me. Either way, it looks like we're gonna lose a base turret here, which kinda sucks. I can't stop them by myself. Caitlyn's pretty strong, two full item. Malphite's full HP too, so it's whatever. Oof. Oh, let me get away. Dang, dude. That Malphite R is nasty. York's trying to solo Baron. He just needs to collapse, though. I mean, as long as Caitlyn dies for killing me, I'm happy with that. Malphite's not easy to chase. He slows you and speeds himself up with his cheese wheels. He knows it, too. That's why he's acting like that. Caitlyn's the one who chunked us there. They are definitely more on the AP heavy side. Draven's trying to FF. 
Yeah. I guess we'll go Force of Nature next. I don't know why he's trying to surrender, dude. I guess he's 1 in 5 and he's a Draven player. We're, we're definitely winning. They don't have a lot of good answers to the York split push. And their base is already extremely soft. Their Evelyn never got a Dark Solar Mesh rolling because she was behind. Uh, so it's going to take her a while to get back into the game. She's going to need Gathering Storm, Absolute Focus, post 30 minute mark to really get back in it. Auto attack E reset. East chunking. Monsters for over 500 punch. Auto. Oh, knock him up. Guess I should just smite that. My hook missed. I could have silenced him out of it. It puts his Q on a lower cooldown whenever you cancel it. Puts it on like a one second cooldown. I don't want to fight Malphite, guys. Leave Malphite alone. Oh my gosh, you're putting him towards me. Malphite burned his R. I'm going to run away from her. I hit her with blue smite. She has an R, obviously, the way she's acting. York's in their base. They just lost. Yeah, they, they legit just lost. We miss our hook like a champ. Let's go, dude. He's, Draven says, this role is boring. Everyone one shots me. <laughs> Oh man, what a game. That was a blast. Let's look at the graphs. Looking at damaged all enemy champions, we were one of the highest in the game. We did uh, almost more than the highest damage dealt on their team. That's pretty good for building kind of tanky bruiser. For damage taken, we were up there. For self mitigated, we were eh, middle ish of the pack. For runes, really good value. Blitzcrank Jungle is a ridiculous amount of fun. This is definitely going to get nerfed next patch. Try to play it before they nerf it. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Kingsticks. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.